Okay, sports fans, uh, it's been a while since we made a video. Without further ado, uh, of course, we're sponsored by Dots Pretzels and Diet Mountain Dew tonight. I got a new fresh cold Diet Mountain Dew right there, and I think I'm out of Dots Pretzels, which is a sin. Okay, so what we're doing right now is we're unboxing something that I bought the other day. And we're going to see what it is. I, I, I've got 16 hand-long tanks, okay? Now this is my first Tygen tank. I'm really excited about it. Now, I, it's another Tiger. And yes, I have one really nice hand long metal tiger. Well, I mean, it's not metal. It's got metal tracks, metal road wheels, metal gearbox, all that crap. But this is from IMAX. And this is a Tygen tank. And it's a Tiger 1 late version, airsoft. Now, the other tank I have is a... Um, and long, but it's an early version. And this is a late version. And look, the box is completely different. Instead of having the fancy black boxes, I got a Tygen tank box. Can you see that? Notice, so this is kind of fun. That's got 007. That's um, uh, Whitman's tank. Michael Whitman's tank. He was the jet ace, or the tank ace in World War II that was, did so many billions of dollars worth of damage. So anyway, that's kind of fun that they got his numbers on this tank. So I'm excited. I haven't had a Tygen tank before. One of the guys on the Hobby Spot says he bought a, a Tygen tank or however you say it, and he thought they were a little bit more, a little bit more quality. So we'll see. Okay. So we got the same damn BBs that we get with every other tank in the world. So evidently whoever makes these RC battle tank power six millimeter ball bullets has a uh, monopoly on them. And then we got accessory box that we get with the uh, and long it's just a different color. But it's the same tank, it's a M32, it's a M41 Walker. So we'll see what's in there. Here is the destructions. There's the instructions for that. Here's our target. We don't have a King Tiger on there like we do on the Hinlong ones, but that's okay. Now, why I was kind of excited about this one, this is a later model, and it's a desert camouflage. Now, my other Tiger is just that brown, uh, that dark, dark, kind of bluish gray one. Oh, okay, here we go. The digital controller. Here we get some white over here. It's a little bit different than the hang long. The hang longs look like yes, this is the one that goes to my new Abrams I can't get running. A little disillusion. It's about the same quality. Looks a lot the same. Got some things up here and we'll have to learn what they are, but digital remote control. You got the same size batteries. Oh, it's a 2000 amp hour, 7.2 volt instead of an 18 amp hour, 7.4. So we'll see how that goes. And then, okay, here comes the main event. Oh, it's pretty. Oh, one thing I noticed right away it comes with all the accessories on it, pretty much. Oh man, this seems gorgeous. Tygen doesn't make an airsoft or a, like, the hang longs are both airsoft and IR. This is, they're either IR or, um, or BB, but this is a BB version, which is fine. But what I want is a color. Look, it has the ropes already on it. It's got the, it's already got the, look at this, it's already got the, the all the, um, um, accessories on it. Look at that. Very detailed. And this has got the Zermatt on there. The Zermatt is the 
is I don't know if you can see this or not, but it's it's, it's, it's where they used to take bead welds on there and put on the the thing so they magnetic hand grenades and stuff wouldn't stick on them very well. Gave them a little bit extra. But boy, so far it looks like it's very well made. And uh, to me, this looks like something that could be kind of flimsy and break off sooner or later. But I guess we'll try it. Make sure that doesn't happen. Luckily, it's the same connector from the hang longs to the pie gym. You know, there's, there's, everybody says the hang longs the lower end of the, the tanks, and I, I agree with that. Just with the hell of it, I, I, I pulled up, I pulled out my, my hang long. That's this big gray one in the back here, and then here's the tie in front, and. I apologize to the hang long. It, the detail on them is really close to the same. You know, like the suitcases in the front, and the, in fact, we got a fun shovel in the front of this one here. So, you know, as far as I'm concerned, now the innards of the of the Tajan looks pretty cool, but they're both great tanks. One thing I kind of like about the Tajan is that it it comes all together with accessories on it, but and I didn't pay a lot for this one. I, this one actually was because of the, this one has the metal uh, tracks on it, where this has the plastic tracks on it and things like that. And this has the metal road wheels on it, where, where this has the plastic ones on, and this has got the metal ones on. And, you know, this one's got barrel recoil and all that on. But it was 300 bucks. So this was actually 100 this was $200. And that was three hundred dollars. So as far as I'm concerned, the you know uh, the value of the Tajan is just as good. Uh, the innards look a little bit different. That's the Hang Long Tiger early version, and this early version because it has the exterior uh, air cleaners on it that goes to feed the big old engine, and this one has internal. The air filters that they did that plus this has a lot more armor on the back where this one they could pierce that so these these were a little tougher but like i said this is a late version tiger one this is an early version tiger one that's it for now sports fans coming to you with dual tiger tanks um, i really like this one thing that's a little bit concerning, the proportional controls on this is really touchy. You gotta be, you gotta be really light on the controls. The same way you move back and forth in turns. So I'm trying to do that as gently as I can. And here's how you shoot it. You raise it up, you raise it down. I think the detail and the, it's, it's, I don't want to say it's better than my hang longs, but I think they are. I really do. Just a few accessories I have to put together on it. I think it's a super tank. I might have to buy another Titan. Without further Mountain Dews. I got Mountain Dew right here. And I've got, uh, I'll have to buy some Doc's Pretzels. Anyway. Subscribe, damn it. Bye.